Matt Roll Wrench. Here we've got this 2013 Yamaha Zuma four stroke, 50cc. Um, it's already got the pipe done on it and it's got the you know, suspension done. The problem is this thing's super slow and we want to solve uh, that issue. So what we're going to do is we're going to install a uh, big bore kit and a transmission kit. And this thing will uh, come to life. So, um, so, so I just want to show you how the speed is right now just from the acceleration. So if you own one of these, you pretty much know what the top speed is already. It's completely wide open right here. The reason I'm doing this is I want to... I want to show you a comparison once this kit is complete. But these bikes are super reliable. They ride smooth as can be. They're a great scooter. Got the uh, Melosi kit with the uh, the uh, tuning box for the ECU. Um, and then we've got the uh, five gram sliders and the uh, um, primary gear kit. This will make the transmission uh, you know, have a higher top speed. You'll have a higher top speed. Than you're doing. Now we got the motor out. And we're gonna pull the top end off and start tearing things down so we can put the top end kit. Alright, so we've got uh, everything torn down all the way down to the rod. We've got our chain here and the gasket's all scraped off. Um, and uh, so here is the, uh, the gaskets. It's gonna come with the kit. The um, cylinder kit, piston rings, and uh, the user's manual and the piston. I want to show you a comparison of how big the pistons are. Here's the old piston, here's the new piston. So here's the old cylinder. And the new cylinder. And then we've got our, uh, our tuning device here. It's kind of like a power commander. We can adjust the uh, air flow. Field ratio. So that's our uh, that's the kit we're going to install here. All right, so here is the finished product. Still need to clean her up, but she's definitely ripped. We've got the quad uh, filter in there. We've got the, I'll turn this off real quick. Oops. We've got the, uh, the tuner, Force Master. You can adjust these. Just a low speed, mid range, and high speed. Um, makes the tuning really easy. Instead of messing with the carpet, just turn these small screws. So we get the pipe, we got the transmission kit, and sliders. Pin the speedometer. 
All right, so the report is, obviously the speedometer only goes up to 40 miles an hour, and then it taps out. We just uh, check the speed on that. It goes 55 miles per hour with this uh, ITAL jet cruising next to it, assuming that that uh, speedometer is correct. I'm sure it is. But somewhere around 55 miles per hour. Remember, we are at a mile above sea level. We lose 20% of our power here. So at sea level, this thing probably gets, her, gets around pretty good. So we'll have this kit on our website at rollingwrenchdenver.com. Um, you can mix and match or buy the whole entire kit.